Alright. That seems to be working. Dun, dun, dun. Dun. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, dun, dun. Hello. Hey, hey, Rocky. What's up? <laughs> oh, not a whole lot. Just my original plan was to do Mario Odyssey with my brother, but then he got called in the work. So now I'm doing this. Oh. <laughs> also, this does not have official controller support, so I have to fire up Joy the Key. So the, yay. That is just. That's interesting. <laughs> Sorry, just I expect most, pretty much all the Undertale fan games <coughs> ah, to have a controller support because the main game did. But um, how's, how's it going, uh, Crash uh, Paradic? I'm the first. Yeah, you are. The, well, the first one in chat. Yeah. Uh, just the brightness on the webcam. <laughs> Doing this uh, filter kind of makes everything dark. And turn the camera up a bit. There we go. So yeah, so uh, I have absolutely no idea what to expect out of this game because someone was just like, "Hey, come try to play this." Um, I guess it's story swaps. I mean, the characters are swapped around. Uh, a CRT effect, while technically possible, would require a bit more work. I, would actually have to I disconnect. Work. I disconnected somehow. I don't know how. No. Oh. All right. I was going for black and white because the battle spreads in Undertale are black and white, but info. Ah. Please do not. Please do not RP any of. Wait. Please do not RP any of the characters, from my interpretation of story swap. Story swap color. Do not use the assets from the game for any project without proper permission. Yes. Huh. Hey, Jan Carlio, welcome back. Credit sprite work blah by Mr. Epic. No, I'm not sure how much. The guy, you're echoing. You weren't echoing before. Wait, uh, am I echoing? Yeah, you are now. I wasn't echoing before, what the hell? Yeah, when you first joined, you weren't echoing, but now you are. That is just weird, hold on. I was just gonna make a comment about uh, how uh, the guy who makes technically makes his fan work can't really enforce that much copyright since the characters themselves aren't fully his own copyright to begin with, as there's modifications of Undertale characters. Uh, Take Sonic Mania stream, huh? Yeah, that, you're still a coin, but that was a while ago. My cat all of a sudden just jumped right up on my lap and started purring. Okay. Can you keep working on the echo, though. If I can get the headphones, hold on. Let me see. Oh, well, yeah, of course. Don't use speakers in voice chat. Problem is, I'm using a portable device. Mm. Well, at least not an iPhone, iPhone uh, 9, right? No, it's a uh, Kindle. Yeah, well, well, I was making a, I was making a joke. I was making, making a joke aimed at the fact that I removed the headphone jack. Though other devices are doing that now, too, unfortunately. Anyway, is the echo one done? Yeah, the, okay, the echo is done. Alright, let's get started then. Yep.
I can still hear, hear a little bit of the video, but... Swampy, level 19. Question mark, question mark, time last quarter, error, error. Oh, because the uh, game is only this one instance. I'm just so... <laughs> it's blue now. So is the true pacifist run on this? You fight Sans? Um... I don't know what happens in Story Swap. I don't really familiarize myself with the AUs, so it's kind of weird. Is this? This is really weird to me. Okay, please turn off the chat. Because story, sw story Swap. I thought that Azrael would swap with Torio. It's... Please turn off the chat bot. It's interrupting my Discord messages. How do you turn off the chat bot, though? Wait, what chat bot? Ex what chat box is he talking about exactly? Oh. The Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, hello, uh, CT Deejer. Welcome to the stream. I do. I don't even know who's saying. Stario Swap um, is when Azrael is Sans. Yeah. Well, anyway, let me uh, let me uh, read the dialogue here. All right. In Storycraft, in Story Shift, Kara is Sans. Oh, all right. So, oh, that's what I was thinking about. Story Shift, not Story Swap. Yeah, I see, these names don't help much either. I mean, I. As how do you keep these straight in your head? Anyway. Uh, howdy. I never thought we'd be here. Not like this. I thought I'd be here saying, good job, you did it. Of course, this is also a kind of a subversion of Story Swap. Story Swap Color, oh. which is this creator's interpretation of Story Swap. So that's even more confusing. But, but, that didn't happen. Instead, you killed everyone. Mom, Dad, Alfies, Kara. You know, I thought, I thought they could do, do it. I thought any of them could stop you. They're so strong, so powerful. None of them, none of them cl- None of them... Oh, could. I, I, I read that as cloud there for a second. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> I'm not strong at all. I can't do this by myself. Kara told me never to trust you. Sorry for game. Alright, then, uh, crash. I think I should have listened. What does that mean? What does that mean by the way, Crash Paradox, that, uh, definitely gave me made you? But now, I know. We want to let you erase it all. Oh, that's a lot of items. That's real jam, but defensive. The true savior of all monsters, but even God's fall. Oh. A little wonky on the controller there. I couldn't go in a straight line. Also, this music's really damn loud. Holy crap, it is. <laughs> Yeah, I had to turn it down. 
I would do. Oh. That's fine, uh, Crash. Man, that would have been awesome to see more Super Mario Odyssey. I mean, yeah. I'm not gonna tell you how many moons there are, but I know there's more than 120 of them. Uh, I think in total, if you want the maximum total, there's 999 of them. Yeah. Ignoring the boat, I think there's 812 or 15 before you unlock the shop that you can buy, you can buy from repeatedly. But then uh, you can keep buying moons from once you get all the moons that you can get from missions. You can keep buying moons from the shop until you get yeah. 999. Oh no! Oh no! Fear not, for for I, the great Papyrus, will cheer you up with this powerful words of wisdom. <clears throat> Swappy, put a little more. Wait a minute, Sans, this is the wrong card. No, I didn't want the one with your face on it. How did that even get there? Wait, could it be? My mere presence has already caused you to cheer up. Assuming those are, assuming those were laughs of happiness, then. <laughs> oh wow, <laughs> that, that is one way to say to stay determined. <laughs> well, because, because uh, Asgore's role got because in this version of things, Papyrus is taking the role of Asgore. Typical Papyrus. <laughs> yeah, audible cough. Call me uh, Paradic. All right. Yeah, I, I prefer um. Asylvania more, but yeah, this isn't a bad song. Ah. Oh, wow. I just was playing Animal Crossing New Leaf and I noticed it's my one year anniversary of my town uh, and I uh, got an anniversary gift from Isabel nice yeah I was like I wasn't expecting that has it been a whole year since what did you what did I you do in the last timeline did you kill us all before is this just a repeat or were we actually happy were we living peacefully with the way things have been I don't believe it you're just like how I was all lazy giving up on your life just because you live in a caddy shack. Does he kind cook? Of, does he like, cook royal spaghetti? Wait a minute, Groundhog Day. I, I got my mute. I got my freaking movies mixed up. I meant to say Groundhog Day. He like life. Hey, with the power of six human souls, I'm nearly a god. Your tax can't do anything while I'm like this. With this power, I can defeat you. Take your souls to res then reset it all. I reconsider my actions. Worth it all in the end. 10 HP restored. I mean... If there was an amazing world of Gumball uh, slash Undertale fan game, Amazing Tale, who do you think would play the role of, like, Sans? Oh, oh wait, Gumball would. Wait, what do you mean? Like... Each of the each of the amazing world of gumball characters. Uh, I have no idea. Because I would I would think that Alan would make a very good uh, Toriel since he's very kind and very positive all the time, and he's a balloon. 
Um, but Darwin okay. would definitely make a good papyrus. And Gumball would definitely make a good Sans. <laughs> but I definitely know what character would be a good role of Azrael. Which is basically yeah, right. Dr. Wrecker. Yeah, Dr. Wrecker, a.k.a. Rob. One thing about the actual uh, Sans fight is the attacks always come at you in a set order, but here they're kind of randomized a bit, so you can't... The level of memorization is not quite... Yeah. ...there that you can do. The whole game's on fire. Ah, I hate this kind of difficulty where it just throws a hundred bajillion different things at you. I mean, it's just, it's easy to program. But difficult to play through, you know? So it's like, it's not very creative difficulty, I should say, you know what I mean? Hey, just put a hundred things on the screen. Like, this attack is a bit more, uh, you know, creative, and in the way you have to dodge it. I'm gonna get all these kind of things do require a bit of work to make sure they're possible, but... I guess you can say I'm not necessarily the biggest fan of the bullet hell genre. Yeah. I'm not really that a big fan of the bullet hell games. But I like, well, I like freaky Cuphead. Uh, the Cuphead is... Cuphead's a hard game, Cuphead. but I don't think it's yeah. really that well designed in the grants. I mean, people who like hard games will like it. That's, you know... But fine, but I mean, yeah, I it, love the challenge of it. But it, Cup, Cuphead has good bosses, bosses and bad bosses. The bad ones are the ones that just like to throw a billion enemies at you, and sometimes you even end up in situations where it's impossible to dodge because you get unlucky with the timing of two of the two of the attacks just hit you at the exact wrong time, making it impossible to dodge. Like someone was recording there, was doing a lecture on it, and it recorded times the where. Jump. He literally couldn't dodge. Like, it was literally impossible. It was... There was, like, a bear... Like, the... That was the one guy that got... That totally raged because he hit a... A freaking jelly bean during the Baroness Von Bonbon fight. Yeah, just... Some combinations of stack... Attacks can stack to... Make an impossible, uh... Yeah. Scenario. Jeez. Oh. Oh, come on. Before I could hang on the edge and not get hit with them. Uh. Oh, Lordy. I could tell. <laughs> uh, I don't know. Too many fan games were obsessed just with being brutally difficult. And I get this is the Sans <laughs> fight, but... I mean, But no refusing. <laughs> Stay determined. Like, let's just throw everything at you. Yeah. Unpredictable. Yep, I died. Yeah. 
You know what? There's two words that I'm pet that pet peeves me what? a lot because of the loud house is hmm. the words literally and told. Just, just because one girl, that's because one of the girls in the loud house would you would use literally a whole lot. And she's like, I'm literally gonna do this, or I'm mm. literally gonna do that, or something that like that. Oh. <laughs> it's like I'm, and also to once upon a time, Toby Fox. What the heck? Okay, that was kind of a light okay. chat. Also, attacks that are beginner's traps like that are kind of annoying, too. Holy moly. Like, I, like I, expected the big, I expected to be dodging the big fireballs. It's like... You're good. It's like, how are... How is, uh... There's one question that I want to ask. What? If she wants to... If she wants Nebby to get, get in the bag... And Nebby's bigger than her, being a Solgaleo, or a Lunala. How is she gonna get him back in the bag? Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's like, how can you get the Devourer of the Sun wait, back huh, in wait, the bag? Huh. <laughs> I can tell if the music actually got quieter in the game, because you're talking, or if, uh... Okay, okay, it did get quieter because it was about to repeat. All right, never mind. I thought there was some significance Ew. there. The live chat's not loading up for me. No, is it not? I finally grow strong. I can't wait to show off my power. Ah. Do, ah! Do, do, do. Every time I die, I have to start over too. It's not like, say, the uh, pacifist boss fight where I get to like I just lose five turns and I have to do them over again. This is uh. yeah. It's too bad it doesn't refuse. Yeah, well, this is genocide, so. So no refusing. So I will say this doesn't implement the karma. Yeah. Which I'm actually somewhat surprised, but then again, karma might 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 make this a little too brutal. Reach for the summer slammer. Okay, finally. Ugh, this is just... It's just a lot of stuff to keep track of. Grief. I can finally see the chat now. Cool. Ah! Fudge hogs. Stinking shuckles. Oh yeah, another thing about the attacks being random too is it gives me less than something to read what he's saying. Because reading what Sans says was a good way to kind of remember what attack he's on. It's like, I think he's on this one chow thing, I don't know. Yeah, I suppose, and I suppose we don't get a lot of detail on how karma works. But I thought the whole point of karma, the lore, ex the lore aspect of karma was that this was the judgment all, so now you're, you know, karma's biting you in the butt. Sans, you gave me the wrong freaking card! Card! Um, sorry that. There... <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's a gameplay mechanic here, right? But I feel like there's a bit of. Lore that's being ignored by not having karma here. Yeah. <laughs> 
I suppose he doesn't move on to the next attack until I hit him. Which means if I keep getting hit and having to heal, I'm not going anywhere except for using up all my food. Hello, humans! That's another thing the Sands fight did that this doesn't do is you have to hit him to progress. For the Sands fight, you always got it was the, it was you always progressed whether you hit him or not. <laughs> oh wow! Crack! I saw you just die there. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of getting annoying. Good grief. I know you can do it. Cake, I know you can do it. Sounds like a dreamer. Oh, so technically shouldn't he be like Omega Flower or something with six souls? I mean, I'm just saying. I mean, I get they kind of have, the, the guy who made this game had a nice touch by making them kind of have those, like, I guess that's, I guess werewolf, actually, never mind. It's kind of werewolfy, or were goatee, I guess I should say. Yeah, it does look like a uh, were goat or something. Bah. <laughs> Smells like J. Smells like Dreamer. <laughs> Smells like Pop Tarts. <clears throat> yeah, if I don't hit him, I have to dodge the same attack again. I hate that. Golly. Speed of weakling of kid whose parents are. I need to be strong. I need the power. Watch, you're probably gonna get dunked by this goat. Well, didn't dunking only happen when, uh. Every time I watched my stats go up or learn something new, it felt incredible. I was finally going strong. I couldn't wait to show off my power. Cause he's like, how about a hug? Ah! You're gonna be my best friend, so how about a hug? And then, and then there's the You're factor bad. that when there's a freaking new attack, I have to go through everything all over again to get to it. I hate, I hate it when games do that. Jeez. You know that, uh, what's it called? The. I can't think of it. My brain's farting. Oh, yeah, Meg uh, Mega Man Maker's got an update. They probably got a few updates since I last, I last played it, but. They added uh, Oil Slider, they added Time Man, they added a few new stuff to it, a whole crap load of stuff. Say this game is Discord.
Oh, I got freaking careless that time. Oh shit, I messed that up. Okay, I disconnected. Well, for what? some curious reason. I was like, what the what? I can't hear my. It. I have all this leftover candy, and I don't know what to do about it. Let's stay determined, brah. Oh man. It's like stay determined breath. Ow, I just freaking hurt my uh, this, it's the worst thing is the stupid food thing. I, if I eat, I have to dodge the same attack again. So it doesn't... I, I can't power through any of it. It forces me to do everything right. You know, like it doesn't allow for much error. God. Like the sand fight, like I, if there was one... If there was a particular attack you knew you weren't good at dodging, you could just save one of the food items for that attack. And then move on. This, but you can't do that with this. This is just... Torment. Just freaking torment. Oh, man. There you get. Mm. Oh. Well, I'm more HP now, so I can move on.
I don't even know if the random's lightning's random or not. I can't see it often enough to even determine that much. See, it's only my third time getting the freaking lightning attack. I need to turn the game volume up a bit. Test, test. Jeez. This game can be so brutal. No. Ridiculous is what it is. I mean, if I like bullet hell, sure, but that's not what Undertale originally was, and that's why a lot of these hard ROM hacks and fan games kind of confuse me a bit. Like, it's a okay game, it's a little bit harder, but this isn't like a natural difficulty curve. Like, this is like as hard as you would like if there was a Sans right fight right after Sans, and you expected a certain like just a little bit of a difficulty increase. This isn't there. And I get the genocide run specifically designed to be un unfun, but this is like a, a way beyond unfair. This beats a uh, freaking this beats freaking Cuphead in unfair. Unfairness, a little bit. Five minutes silence for this chat. Wow. This is some Robo Rocky. Wait, what? Okay, so we can't hear you. All right. Can they hear me? Yeah, they can. I was just checking. Also, apparently my computer can record and stream at the same time. Um, I didn't mean to be, but I'll keep that in mind in the future. Maybe I can use that for something. Probably gonna go and snack on on some of my leftover candy. Ugh. Come on now. Uh. Jeez, now I can't see the screen. All I see is the the, the live thing in the big. This is the, this is the time I'd say I want to kill a child. Why? Which child? Chris or Para? And what character are you playing as, anyways? It's the wrong number. <laughs> uh, apparently, Sloppy is the character I am. But I assume it's just this universe's version of Chris. 
<laughs> I'm not gonna beat this by the end of the stream. I can keep throwing myself at this, but I'm not beating this. Rage quit. <laughs> I'll keep throwing myself in this a little while more so just to pound out the stream a bit, really more than anything, but. It's just. Ridiculous. It's not worth it. Like, this is, like, beyond, like, what I normally. the skill level of games I normally play at. It's just not worth it for me to keep throwing myself at this. It's more so a battle of nutrition than any skill on my part, you know? Like, yeah, if I keep playing this a hundred times, eventually I'll beat it, but. That doesn't really feel satisfying. Um, like maybe if there was a whole game and there's like an undying fight before this, I could, you know, up, you know, get, I could use to get better on. It's slightly easier than this. This is just a nightmare. Uh, the thing here is Asriel is acting the role of Sans here because this is uh, th this takes place at the end of a genocide run in the, the story swap area, so I just kill everyone. So really, we're the bad guys in this, and he's the one trying to keep the world from being destroyed. Hmm. Crunch. Yeah, it's safe to turn Blah, blah, blah. Wait, I know you can do it, Kevin. I'll be right back. Yeah, but I don't know uh, who actually plays the role of the flowery fight in this AU. So you think Story Swap is a swapped version of Story Ship? It sounded like you threw it at the controller. Well, I really just kind of dropped it gently. Well, I dropped it gently, but my mic's also on the desk, so it caught the vibrations. Uh, I'm not having fun. 
I, I don't have I don't really have any interest in even doing this. To be honest. Nope. No fun at all. It's a beautiful day. It's a beautiful day outside. Not really, it's not a very beautiful day outside from where I'm living. Like, mostly starving. Oh, come on. Shoot, this warhead's almost completely melted. Stay determined. Hey, okay, what's up, guys? I'm getting beat up on over bad guys. Don't deserve. That was like Azrael. Yep. What the fuck knows though? Well, Azrael's not even the bad guy. I'm the bad guy in this scenario. No, what's with that nose? Well, he's a goat. And also, that's also... You have the little, like, scruff of his nose, but then you also have his mouth, too. So the dude dot dots are his mouth. You know what I mean? Like, it's not just his nose, but his mouth and his neck and his muzzle is all there, you know? Mm-hmm. So, uh, that whole thing isn't his nose. There comes a time in your life you have to look inside yourself and say, What am I willing to put up with today? Not. Wait, you're not gonna finish this? Congratulations! Fandom, you just officially ruined Undertale. First the row 39, and now this. And now they ruin Undertale. Like, this is a really hard fan game. That's all this is. You know, there comes a point where you have to look inside yourself. You have to say, what am I willing to put up with today? Not fucking this. Nope. Not this. Oh, you, do you even know what Sorry. I was do, do you even know what I was referencing, Rocky? What was it? Game Grump, Sonic 06. <laughs> You, you, say, gotta, you, you gotta draw a line in the sand and say, What am I willing to put up with today? Not fucking this! Hey, <laughs> hey, listen to me. We can do it alone. Because I know you can't do this without you. And I know you can't do this without me. <laughs> Look what we're dealing with, man! 
don't know, I might be misquoting that by a lot, but... Oh my gosh! <laughs> Yeah, and I'm not, like, tired tired. Like, I'm not nearly... Like, I am a little tired, but I'm not, like, as tired as I look. This is just the combination of tired plus stress kind of coming together, you know? I'd be a... I mean, this isn't the Undyne fight where I can just go, da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-